I've never seen it that crazy in a KFC before. First drive through experience, eh? Oh, look, the other oh side. Oh my gosh. Imposter. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, what? Whoa. What's happening free game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From, not our home, that's our home in London, Stonehenge. You see it? All the rocks back there. And it's a really nice day to be here. Even the scarves come with us. That doesn't mean it's a really nice day. I don't know, for you it's a nice day, it means you're warm. I actually just came up with a really good joke. Uh, what do you call it if you're playing a guitar by Stonehenge? What? Rock and roll. Rock and roll, okay. I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad you're you all managed to hear that. Let us know where you guys are coming live or not live from. We'd love to hear where you are in the world and how things are going in your world. We hope everything is going very, very, very good. Yeah, so we're traveling in the van at the moment, guys. We didn't want to go too far because we're coming home for Jojo's birthday, which is very soon. And we're going to see Jamie again this week. So we're just sticking around the south, really, aren't we? Yeah, but we really wanted to come here again because I'm just fascinated by these stones. But what are they, guys? What are they? We're not Comment doing below. this again. Comment below. I want to know. What, what are these things up here? Let me put you on the spot. How do they get there? What are they? What do you think? Okay, so I think we may have said this last time, but basically a rock giant was building, like a baby rock giant, or like a toddler, was building with his building blocks. And then his mum came in and said, Timmy, we're going to the shops. Okay, mama. And just left them there. Okay, you mummy, what are you saying? I think it's some kind of ancient civilization. And they put it as a monument or what? I don't know. It's up some kind of sundial. Basically, neither of you have a clue what it is. What do you think it is then? Yeah, what do you think it is? I think it is a magical portal to another realm, but you need to know how to tap into the energy that's contained within. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, do not ask what's going on with my hair today. I have no idea. I think the best thing is we every, all of the free gang should comment below on what's going on with Katie's hair because it's clearly an interesting question that needs to be solved. Is it more important though than where did Stonehenge come from? Well, clearly maybe, it is. Maybe it was Stonehenge, the energy of it that did it. Don't ah, make excuses like that. It was all that energy that messed my hair up. Reminds me of last time when you had that little fall, remember when we were here last time? We sneaked into Stonehenge. I and fell over. You, yeah, and you said it was the energy to do with Stonehenge. You, you sneaked Oh, it. yeah. Yeah, that energy messes with people's hair, makes people fall over. Makes people talk complete nonsense. Yeah, that was a video when we came here before when you saved my life. I didn't. Oh, don't even start with that. Did not save your life. Why are you grabbing me like you're all like grateful? Get off me. You saved my life. You're a hero. I know. That video was so funny, guys. <laughs> I'll put that video in the comments below, guys, because that was such a funny video. After you've watched this one, go and watch that. We were actually talking as well about maybe coming here for the summer solstice, which is 21st of June, because they have a big gathering here. They open it up to everyone in the public. It's completely free, but they reckon there could be about 20,000 people here. Yeah. But you can go up close to the stones and everything then. We're just trying to figure out how we'd, where we'd park and stuff like that. It's not so easy, they close a lot of things down. Anyway, should we head back to the van and have some breakfast now? Come on, nice then. cup of tea. Breakfast! So Katie's chopped up a watermelon for breakfast. We mentioned in a previous video that a favorite way of eating watermelon is chopping it, in, chopping it into what you call watermelon chips. Not so practical in a van though, because you're talking about juice going potentially everywhere. Easier on a kitchen side in a house. True. So she's going to be eating it straight out of there like a bowl. Who's she? Her, you. I've got a really good tip of the day as well. Katie tip of the day. Everyone knows that you can eat a watermelon like this, but what you don't know is that you can actually use it as a bowl later for other things i can't take full credit for this tip of the day though because i actually got it off somebody else <gasps> imposter so yeah once we've eaten all this if you do like a rice dish or a pasta dish later you can eat out bit and it saves on the washing up and then you just throw these away later we did it last time didn't we we did we made a fried rice dish in it and it was really nice but obviously you cannot do it more than once because this will go mouldy eventually. You can do it in the same day, that's it. So while we're eating that, how about we get a cuppa on as well, mummy? Mm. What you got going on up here, Jojo? I'm playing with the Scrabble tiles. So you're just making words yourself or something? Yeah. You're making a lot of noise, I know that. Hey, don't eat that over the bed. Come away, please. That's gonna go everywhere otherwise. I'm not one of the 
kids, you know. No, but it sprays uncontrollably, and this is your side. In fact, do it all you want. It's your side of the bed. You might end up with a Scrabble tile in there tonight as well. So those of you that follow our Instagram, you would have seen that we were in Bath recently, a city around the west of England. I don't think I've been there since I was a kid. Yeah, if you guys want a really, really nice day out or like a weekend away or something, go to Bath. It's so beautiful. I mean, to be honest, we didn't do much there. We went there specifically for a vegan festival, but everything we saw around there looks so nice. I really mm. definitely want to go back. They've got hot springs there as well, which you can bathe in. I'm definitely going back there. It's amazing. If you guys have got any other recommendations of really good cities or places to go, which have got really nice scenery or things to do, let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear your recommendations. So today, guys, we've got a very different and special fun video video for you today. We've got a nice surprise for you Jojo. Yes, this is something which you have never done before Jojo. What is it, jumping into a volcano? No, that's next week. Oh, Ooh. So it's something you've wanted to do recently. Can okay. you remember what we said, what you wanted to do? No. Go through a drive through Oh yeah, I really wanted to do that. I think you guys know we don't get a lot of takeaways, things like that or junk yeah. food, do we? <laughs> And having a van, the point is, is that you can take your home and your food and everything else with you. However, this is actually quite good timing because we've run out of food. We have we've, a few things. But not really things. enough to make a good meal or a very interesting meal it would be if we did. And so we're going to find a drive through in the area. Here's the catch, Jojo. You are going to be in charge of it all. You're going to order the food and you're going to collect the food, speak at the window and everything. We're going to have to quickly swap seat. Are you up for this? Yes. So there's a bit of a challenge in this, guys. We can't just find any old drive through in the area and just go to it. We need to find one which doesn't have a height restriction to stop our van going in, because most of them do have a height restriction. I mean, it's probably lucky, really, because could you imagine? We might be going through them a lot more. I say you think it's doing us a favour. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's stopping us from being junked out by junk food. I know. Also, I, I, I had a thought as well, right? So do we want to know this? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> because you guys have, pr have probably wondered this too at some point. Why do you order your food at the speaker, but then collect your food and pay for it at the window why don't you just mm. do it all at the window some big questions being asked today you know stonehenge what is it why was katie's hair out of control and why do they have this separate system at drive throughs free gang you've got some work to do in the comments let us know no but some of them i think you've watched you've watched videos where that it's been separate but i think some of them do it together do i think they? some of them do <gasps> well what kind of one are we going to find today jojo so if i look at the different ones in the area okay there's quite a few about here and there but you've okay. got to find one without a height restriction i know i'm gonna have to go into the street view because they don't list it as part of their like information of the store and that mm -hmm. van life it makes some things complicated unless you've got a small van so okay coming into the car park this one no that one has one okay move on to the next one see that one's got one as well yeah there's there's so many with the height restrictions it's crazy okay this one doesn't look like it has one look guys so you're having to look around the car park just to see if there's a height restriction there but this one looks okay so maybe if we go to oh look the other oh side oh my gosh there's a van guys about the same size as ours if you need any sort of clear indication it's not a volkswagen though it's a peugeot well, it's about the same size i don't care about make oh. yeah look it's about the same size, Ooh. height and everything. That's good. So I think we're good. There. We found one. It's a KFC. You have you confident with KFC? Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with KFC. I mean, I don't know what else to order but burger and chips. <laughs> they do a vegan burger. They do things like beans. We just have to see when we get there. Yeah, right? but well, I mean, they've got menus, I bet. So. All right, let's jump in the front and go. Come on. Here we go. Here we go, Jojo. You excited? Yeah. First drive-through experience, eh? Oh, KFC's there. Why do they spell through on drive through wrong? I don't know. It's shorter, probably. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, what? Whoa! It's got a height restriction. What the heck? What? What? So look! Oh, hang on, there's a lorry there, Bob. No, 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 it's just parked in there. Look to the left of it. Oh, no! We're holding up people now. Oh, no. Look, let's, let's go back around it. People are looking at us for some reason now. <laughs> because we've stopped here and screamed, basically. Oh, fuming. What about a van? We saw the van that... But it must be new. It must be a new thing. Yeah, why do be... they do this? Oh, um, Jojo. This is a whole retail park kind of place. There's a McDonald's. There's and a McDonald's over there. And a Costa, so and they're both drive throughs I can see the restriction on Costa though, so we'll try McDonald's, okay? Okay, it's not all lost. <laughs> There's a McDonald's. I... No, that's not even open. What? It's completely closed. They've still fenced off. 
the Toby Carvery. Do they have a drive-through? Lidl's. <laughs> Lidl's <laughs> drive-through. The only thing we can get a drive-through for around here is petrol. Oh, Pizza Hut. Do they have one? I don't know if they do. We'll go over there and try. This is annoying. I feel really bad because we just really got you excited for this, didn't we, Jojo? Oh, no. I'm yeah. sorry. No, Pizza Hut don't do it either. Don't have a drive-through. I'll tell you what, let me just park up and we'll have a look about some other ones in the area. Okay, park because, there. Because let's be fair, we're all hungry and we don't want to drive around too much for this. This is a bit annoying, isn't it? Yeah. I know, I just feel really bad because of how excited we got Jojo for this. <laughs> sorry, Jojo. It's okay. So I've just had a look on the phone, guys. It seems that none of them, not in this anywhere near this area, of all the ones we've looked at, none of them don't have a height restriction, which is stopping the van from getting in there, which I find really weird. What about workmen? Yeah. Yeah. What Do they just expect you to park up? Those are the people which get most attracted to it, workmen. Because of yeah. the convenience of just pulling up, grabbing it and going. Yeah. yeah, because they're busy and they need to just grab their food and go. Like, what about these workmen? Like, what? I don't get why they've got a height restriction on, them, on yeah. it. Yeah. No. And I don't understand that van. It must have been lower than ours. In the picture we saw because i thought we that definitely was perfect saw, it was definitely there in that picture i definitely saw a van yeah. roll back so go back same size as ours you see right do you still want specifically kfc uh yeah i'd still want to go to kfc okay the problem is though we're gonna have to walk in there oh no i'm sorry jojo oh 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 i've got an amazing idea i can make it up to you this is going to be the best idea ever okay what it's a surprise okay Sorry about the walk in, Jojo. It's okay, it's okay. They should do a walk through. Can you not walk in and just like go up to the window? That's yes. how it is normally. All right, here we are. Come on, Colonel. Why did you put in the height restriction? Here you go with your walk through, you two. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what they do, yeah? So, okay. yeah. there we go. That's nice and easy. This is a first, Jojo. <laughs> yeah. So, vegan burger, yeah? So we want three of those, yeah? Yeah. One each? Yeah, we get three of those. And, oh, oh beans, beans, beans. Just get two, just get two. two. Just two beans? Have they got corn? Are they, yeah, they got corn. Lot of large fries each? Yep, just fries. Let Jojo have a go, you're hogging it. Sorry. Go on, Jojo, you have you a go. corn on the cob? I think I want corn on the cob as well. Okay, actually not. We'll get one, and then one for you, one for me. Do you want that one, That would be cheaper, wouldn't you? Yeah, get yeah. two lots of the four. Three burgers. Three chips, two beans, two corn. Yeah. Happy with that? Yeah. You're paying, mate? No. <laughs> so, Jojo, how was your first, well, not your first actually, walk in experience? <laughs> it, was, it was good. It was good, was it? Yeah. <laughs> now, Mummy, I'm very intrigued to see what surprise you've got in store with this food. We're going to do something fun, okay? Yeah. I'm going to get in first, and you're going to get in the driver's seat, okay? Okay. Daddy, you need to stay outside. Uh, goodbye. Okay. I'll start here then. Yeah. Okay, you start there. So, Daddy's going to be the per the drive through person. Okay. Oh, are you eating the chips? Yes, he is. I can see his mouth munching away. You're so cheeky. So, are you ready for your first fake drive through experience? I am. Right, Jojo, you're going to need some money. Okay. It smells nice. The food will probably smell better. Okay, Jojo, what we're going to do, we're going to pretend to go through a drive through and you're going to order from the person outside, okay? Okay. Go on then. Hello. Hello. Can I take your order, please? Yes, can I have two double corns? Okay, two double corns. Three vegan burgers. Yep. Three fries. Yep. And two beans, please. Two pots of beans? Yeah. Okay, would you like any drinks with that? Uh, no, thank you. Would you like a song and dance? Okay, go on. No. That's uh, £28.42. He's please. only got £20. That's £20, <laughs> please. Thank you. You drive to the next window. Hello. Hello there. Vegan burgers, fries, corn and cold beans? Yes. There you go. Uh, Thank you very much. much. Okay. Have a great time. Thank you, you too, bye. Okay, Jojo, did we make up for that drive through fail? In fact, it was actually quite fun. It was quite fun. Okay. So, you know, as a staff member, I had to test the chip to make sure the products that my customers were getting was good. Okay. I really like to test the other stuff now, though. Yeah, I feel like we should put this out and have a nice little tablecloth so that we don't get anything on the bed. You don't want to be waking up with a chip, do you? Not really. You'll be having a midnight feast, mummy. Okay, guys, here we go. We've got a nice spring water for drinks. We've got our own Himalayan sea salt. Good. Some vegan salad cream and a very small amount of ketchup. That's not going to go very far. You guys can have it. Okay. Um, oh, corn on the cobs. 
Do you guys remember the last time we had KFC? Yeah. I swear it was about three years ago. Yeah, it was when they first bought our vegan burger. Mm -hmm. And we went to the only place they had it in London where they were testing it and trialing it. And the whole place was heaving with people trying to get the burger. Oh my goodness, yeah. Well, you couldn't get in the door. No, no, you? there was about 30 or 40 people. And there was just this one guy that just wanted a non-vegan burger. I yeah, know. It, it, all the vegans have just gone there to get these burgers. It shut day. down the kitchen, didn't it? And they had like, please just wait. I know. We've got 23 burgers to serve you. Wow, that was... We, we had got six that day, though. I think we got three or four for ourselves and took a couple home for Sam and Emily. I've never seen it that crazy in a KFC before. No wonder they decided to do the burger permanently. Ready to receive your non drive through burger? Yep. And chips. Oh, and chips. Oh, hold oh, on. Sorry. Rookie mistake, Jojo. Got to hold both sides. Do you know what you should do? No. Put the chips in the burger. You just couldn't help yourself, could yeah, you? Yeah, I'll do, do that. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put the chips and the beans in my burger. Oh, okay. In that case, then, I'm going to put the chips, the beans, and the corn on the cob in the... That's not going to work, is That's it? That's not going to work. Yeah, it's going to be... Yeah, okay. No, no, no. I'm just I'm just going to have the burger, probably. Free gang, this is art in its truest form. Oh, some salt going on there. Good. Oh. Is that grunting sound an enjoyable one? Mm -hmm. Did you take too much of a big bite? Why has Nathan got his hands behind his back? <laughs> Nathan, what are you up to? What are you hiding behind there? Is he taking a chip? Yeah, maybe. Put your hands around. Come on. Now, mummy's obnoxious face for eating. <laughs> mm. It's good, isn't it? Mm. Maybe we need to get Free Gang to vote who eats the burger the best. We've got a clip of each of us now. No. You didn't put the Hello, chips. You haven't ha had a bite of yours yet. I know, that's what I'm saying after this. But you didn't put the chips and beans in your one and take No, no, a bite. no, because I wanted to take a bite first without it. She talks big, Free Gang. She talks big. I would not vote for you. I would not vote. Who would you vote for? Me. Oh, or Jojo. Really? No, Jojo, that was a good hey, vote. Look, but... look, you should vote for me because I'm so kind. I'm going to feed the free gang as well. Yum, 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 yum. No, your bite was way too big. Too big? <laughs> Listen to you, big mouth. So, big question, Jojo. How was your first ever non drive through experience? It was a good 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10? I salvaged that, mummy, didn't we? <laughs> it, was, it was funny. Otherwise, it would have been like a six or something. Anyway, today's not all lost. As when we have been looking around for a drive through we actually found a soft play area for you, Jojo. Hey. So how about we go there now, yeah? So that's where we're going to end this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We really enjoyed doing content for you guys while traveling around in our van. But we will see you all in the next video. Just remember, guys, no matter where you are in the world, you guys always stay free. And just keep rising. Keep rising.